Hey guys, and welcome back for another shaving soap review. And today we're going to take a look at Sir Hair Third Eye. And as always, we give you the scent profile as described by Sir Hair. Take a look. And here's a quick shot of the ingredients. All right, so as always, we talk about packaging first. And the packaging on this is superb, I think. It's a nice heavy gauge tin. Um, the label is, is excellent. It's waterproof. The name of the soap's even on the side. I give this a 10. I think it's truly excellent packaging. Now the consistency of this soap is uh, so in between soft and medium. Um, it does yield when you press it, but not easily. So sort of in between soft and medium. Um, the quality of this scent, it's a very nice, relaxing scent. Uh, when I first got this, I reached out to Sir Hare because I told him I can't hardly get any scent at all out of this soap. So they sent me another one and I compared the two. And what it is, the scent that I was looking for isn't here. I'm used to a very spicy, um, very loud, if I can use that even as a descriptor for a scent, a very uh, robust, spicy, zesty type sandalwood. And this is not it. This is a nice mellow sandalwood and vanilla. So for me, I prefer the zesty type sandalwood, so I'd give it a five. But I will say, if you like a nice mellow, relaxing type scent, this very well um, be one that you like a lot. Um, in terms of performance, I give it a nine. This guy performed absolutely wonderfully. No problem lathering, nice slickness, cushion glide. And I can't tell you how much Sir Hare has improved from the first version of the soap they put out. They have really improved their quality uh, quite a bit. Oh, and cost, uh, this was, I believe, $11.99, and it's four ounces, and it's filled, I mean, all the way to the top. So uh, it's about $2.99 an ounce, which I think is a pretty good price. So I give it about an eight uh, on the cost score. On customer service, 10. I reached out to them, and they're like, if you can't smell it, we'll send you another one, and they did. And what I'm gonna do is, I'll eventually do a giveaway for the one they sent me um, that was uh, extra. So, um, what would I say about recommendation on this? Who do I recommend this for? Not for people who are looking for a Tobbs type spicy vivid sandalwood scent. This is mellow. The vanilla and the sandalwood really mix. It really is a um, harmonious mix. I prefer something with a little more zest and zip, but if you're looking for relaxing, calm and nice, this might be for you. So um, if you if you sort of uh, fit the profile of the ladder, you might want to try this. All right, let's go ahead and uh, show you a quick palm lather or hand lather, whatever you want to call it. As I said before, the performance on this was very nice. The lather was very creamy, not, and you can see already, look at that, very creamy. In fact, I'm slinging it all over my phone. Um, really, really nice quality stuff and, and like I said before the first soap they put out you could not lather it I mean this is a long time ago they didn't complain they didn't raise cane they didn't take it uh, as an affront they went back and worked on it and look at what we have now look how creamy that is I don't know if you can see that but this is exceptionally creamy so in terms of quality I mean this soap is really excellent I think the only question is going to be is this mellow type of scent for you, and uh, you you have to decide that. Of course, I can't, but I tell you right now, super creamy stuff here. Just excellent. So, bravo, Sir Hare, for going back and working on your formula. This is what you get. You know, really good stuff. Excellent. All right, guys. Thanks, as always, for watching. Have a great day.